Damn. Yeah. Boom. So these are the 10 and a half, so these are even wider. <laughs> What's up guys, George from Sac City Auto Parts. Uh, we got a new set of wheels in. This is actually gonna be for the new Z. They are Kanzai, so I'm gonna open them up for you right now. Shout out to them for sending us two sets, super fast. Let me open these up real quick and show you guys what wheel set we got for the new Z. So we don't really know exactly what we're gonna do with the new Z. There's so much new accessories and stuff coming out for them. So it's like, we don't wanna just like pull the trigger on something major and then be like, oh my God, the other thing was so much cooler. So we decided to go with Kanzai's and kind of just give it a new look, something different. Uh, we weren't all a big fan of the bronze wheels that the stock ones came with. So we decided to go with these. I love the packaging they get on this thing. So we're gonna go with black. Got some black gloss gunmetal black Kanzai's at Astros going in, uh, so it's gonna be the nine and a halfs in the front, 10 and a halfs in the back, with the biggest offset that they have. So uh, we're gonna go on and check it out on the new Z. Gotta get the exercise in. All right, I'm excited. Let's see how these things are gonna fit. I think, uh, I think they're gonna be pretty good. Yeah, I mean, we were using some crazy scrapers on them before, super long ones. Ooh, they clear the brakes well. That's gonna tuck in, that's gonna tuck in perfect. Okay. I know we don't want to go with the same tires. Nissan, don't put no Bridgestones on Z's anymore, man. I can't do this. It's terrible. But, probably gonna go with some Pirelli P0s or just something sticky, because you want to drive the car and it doesn't grip for anything. You can't even hit it curve. So that's a nine and a half. We're gonna do 10 and a halfs in the back. I'll open that right now. Boom. So these are the 10 and a half, so these are even wider. <laughs> This is gonna be interesting. Hulu. And the cool thing with Kanzai is they come with a hula hoop. No, I bought that extra. It was an adult. Oh, it was extra? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Here, I'll return it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get back to those. So, these were on the back. Yeah, 40 millimeter rears. Why do I always do this, bro? There should be 20, 20 nuts there. What happened here? What the hell happened there? Nothing. I see nothing. Uh, look at that. Damn. Yeah. I feel way more comfortable too because it's not with 40 millimeter spacers. So tires are definitely gonna be the deciding factor right now, I guess. We'll probably go with, I'm gonna go check it out right now. Actually. We'll go check it out. Okay guys, quick break from the video. I wanted to show you guys this merch that we are launching on our website alwaysmoveco.com uh, you could also win the green z uh the wide body one we've been showing you guys on our instagram handle and everything this jacket right here is the sac city rain jacket it gets you 10 entries to win that z go ahead and check us out on that website now let's get back to the z all right guys so i went ahead and uh went with the michelin pilot 4 s's these wheels are super meaty and they're practically one of the best ones to put on so they didn't make these for Nissan. So the back ones are, I think, Jaguar uh, Michelin Pilot 4S's and the front ones are Mercedes. But you could already tell just from the sidewall itself, it, it looks so nice. I love going with the Pilot 4S's. So we're gonna go get these fitted real quick on the Kanzai's and then start from there. Wheels are in, tires are in. Originally I said the Pirelli P0s, but we're going with the Michelin Pilot 4S's. These things look really good. We went with the original tire spec, so let's see how they look. No spacers, that's the best part. Getting the bronze out, like the bronze was so random. Yeah, honestly, like I was driving it and then I like I was pulling up after the store. I know what they did, it looks good. Like it was, a, it was the essence of the colors, just kind of becoming this like bronze color, but yeah, I, I hate it. I feel like it's the dumbest thing I could have ever done. <laughs> if there wasn't so much like silver and like grays on it, yeah, I would get the bronze thing. That's the thing with the Michelins. They have the sidewall that's so flat. It's not like the Pirellis or even those Bridgestones. They're like more rounded, so they have more room to fit under the fender.
All right, guys, so here it is. I see the reflection over there, but I want to show you guys right there. Uh, got those 19 inch Astros wrapped in some Michelin Pilot 4S's. We finally got the alignment kind of like dialed in. I still need some camber arms to make it perfect. Uh, but the vision for this car was to make it like a sticky car. Um, I was driving the Z with those Bridgestones and I kept hating about it because it just wouldn't stick. So after the alignment and these Michelin Pilot 4S's, they stick now. So uh, check it out, see what it's all about. And honestly, we went with another touch too. Uh, shout out to Sport and Graphics for this. Sean designed this logo right here that just kind of was like a, kind of like a decal just representing our company and everything. So I think it looks and honestly adds a lot of touch to the car. Uh, just matching the design over here with the trim that Nissan originally put along with the roof line being black as well uh, But here are some more videos make sure to hit that subscribe button because I don't know if that helps yet But I'm sure it helps so make sure to hit that subscribe button and we'll see you guys on the next video